Hi, this is Mike Schmitz, and welcome to another weekly tip video. Today we're going to look at a handy text utility called SuperKey. SuperKey gives you a couple of simple keyboard enhancements for your Mac, including two we're going to look at today, setting up a hyperkey to simulate complicated key presses for custom keyboard shortcuts, and the ability to search for and action text on your screen. I first came across SuperKey as I was looking for an alternative to Better Touch tool, which I covered in a previous tip when the HyperKey stopped working after a macOS update. I couldn't get Better Touch tool to remap the caps lock key anymore for my custom keyboard shortcuts, and I found that SuperKey did the job nicely. It's a one-time cost of $15.99 US dollars, but you can use it for free for 20 days before purchasing so you can decide if it's right for you. First, let's take a look at using SuperKey as a hyperkey. As I mentioned in the intro, I came across this app when I needed to find a replacement for Better Touch Tool. My Mac updated and Better Touch Tool was not able to remap the caps lock key to the Shift Control Option command like I'd been used to for many years. But SuperKey fixes this. And if you don't want to spend the money on SuperKey, there's another application by the same developer called HyperKey, which just does this one thing. But basically what we want to do is we want to remap a key to a hyper key and we can select from a list of modifiers here. I have this set to caps lock. I also have the box checked to include shift in the hyper key. So that means when I press the caps lock key, it simulates a control option command shift press and it allows me to activate some keyboard shortcuts that aren't going to be conflicting with anything else in my system. Now there's another feature here called the Mac key, and this is one that remaps a certain key to control option and command. I have this set to right option, and I can use that to create additional keyboard shortcuts on my system. So for example, here's keyboard maestro, and I have a basic macro here to open obsidian anytime I hit shift control option command O. Now I've remapped a bunch of that to the hyper key. So when I press caps lock O, so when I hit caps lock, you'll see all those modifiers get added at the same time, and then all I have to do is hit the O key to open Obsidian. Now let's take a look at a shortcut with the Mac key. I use Control Option Command D in order to access Drop Zone. Drop Zone is a shelf app that I use frequently on my Mac. I'll throw images and things up there before I put them inside of Keynote slides or drag them into my Obsidian Vault when I want to attach them to a specific file. So I can access drop zone by hitting control option command D or by pressing the right option key, which simulates the key press of those three modifier keys, then just hit the D key and I can access drop zone from my menu bar. 